Ah, welcome. <laughs> welcome to myself and welcome to everyone who's coming back. Uh, it's been a long time since we actually recorded. But um, I just want you to know that this is a very special number. You are on episode 50. Ooh, <laughs> ba, 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 ba. Yeah. Thank you so, so much for having me. Yeah, so um, I've been trying to build up towards this uh, episode 50. Please. But um, I guess... Uh, the destiny has brought you to become the, the 50th uh, episode guest. But yeah, um, enough about the drama before. Yes. <laughs> I just want you to just introduce yourself and uh, what you do. Okay. Um, so my name is Pumli Safe. Um, I'm a somatologist or somatology graduate. I studied at CPUT. Yeah, I love people. I love working with people and I love touching people. Okay. And I love making people feel better about themselves, you know. Okay. I'm all for that. Nice. Yeah, that's me in a nutshell. Um, thank you so much for that. Um me and you, we kind of like grew up in the same generation. Yeah. And I, I don't think no one taught about about somatology. Yeah. I just want you to tell me, how did you get to know about somatologists and why did you choose somatology? Funny enough, um, I also didn't know about somatology only when I had to apply, you know, the late applications. Okay. Yeah, so I had to apply for the course. I was like, oh, what is this? I saw health. It was in the Department of Health and Wellness. Yes. But now it's only in wellness science only okay. now, yeah. But I was like, oh, there's somatology. I was like, hmm, what is this? It sure. sounds interesting, you sure. know. Let me apply for this. But I know I was influenced, because I grew up in Johannesburg, mm -hmm. Western area. So I was influenced by the sisters at church. They owned their own salons and, you know, I was like, ooh. But it was mainly like nails and hairdressing. Mm. So, yeah, that's what influenced me. I wanted to own my own, like, salon. Mm. Yeah. So funny enough, I understood when I applied that, oh, this, it has a bit of salon inside. So, yeah. So, were you were you a hairdresser back in your days? Back in my days, I was not. I <laughs> like hairstyles. Is it? Okay. Yeah, but I was not a hairdresser. Oh, you liked it for yourself? The what? Uh, the hairstyles. No, yeah, but I liked owning it because I okay, would see sure. the, the, the women, it was mainly women in, 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 in business mm. who owned their own salons, sure. how they look, how they carried themselves. Mm. So obviously I wanted to associate myself with them. I was like, oh, one day I would like, still today, sure. I would like. <laughs> nice. Yeah, yeah. But it, sounds, it really sounds cool because, uh, like I said, it, it's, mm. it's very hard to actually find someone who says I want to be a somatologist. Yeah. And when you get to do some ontology. So when you get into studying it, mm -hmm. what what is it that you find interesting and maybe some of the shocks that you actually find when you're actually studying it um, mm -hmm. at CBT? Oh, okay. So somatology is a very interesting course and it's quite unique, you know. <laughs> so because uh, many, most people, they think somatology is, it's like beauty and uh, massage you know mm. but it's broader than that we deal with the holistic holistic of the person like your mind mm -hmm. your body and your your, your well-being mm -hmm. like we don't just touch the the surface only mm. so it is broad so if in somatology we get to learn about the whole the whole body so even the word somatology it's, it comes from a greek meaning soma soma means body Mythology mm -hmm. study of so it's mm -hmm. the study of the human body. Okay. So within somatology, we get to do anatomy and physiology, where you get to learn how your blood circulate, mm -hmm. how the muscular system or the skeletal system work, mm -hmm. uh, the lymphatic system, different systems of the body. So you it's it, it's it's broad. And then obviously we believe that uh, you are what you put inside. Mm -hmm. There's a subject called nutrition, okay. where you get to understand like food what it plays 
to us in our to well-being the to the okay. body sure. we also did biotics biotics it's more about exercise different types of exercise the body how it works you know as well so obviously you have to keep fit you know that's where sure. the holistic uh, mm. part of somatology comes from and then there is also the phys- uh, social psychology mm-hmm. where we study the human mind how people think as well how yes so it's it's not just a uh, beauty only mm. but it it's a very nice course if you want to understand the person as a whole the whole being of a person the whole wellness of a person so it's a very interesting course mm. it's very nice i i enjoyed it mm. <laughs> i enjoyed it, it yeah in, it must be in, interesting because yeah. as, as you're explaining it now um mm. I, I, it seems like there is a similarities between medicine I don't, I don't, maybe medicine let me use medicine yeah. medicine and somatology mm. what what similarities what what are the difference that you have with medicine in terms of uh, the detail that you go into because mm-hmm. i know medicines they also do like the study of the the body, body. i guess yeah but uh, in terms of uh, the the extent how much do you guys get into the the extent of understanding the, the body okay uh, so okay we're going to discuss the body in two ways okay because okay. we're going to look at it in two ways so there is the facial side of the of somatology mm-hmm. and then there is lower part to the body side of somatology oh, okay. sure. Sure. yeah so we it's either we're dealing with the facial side or the body side. Okay. So within the facial side, you know almost the face or the skin is the epidermis, the first layer, and then the dermis and then the hypodermis. Okay. So us as somatologists, we work within the epidermis. We don't go to the dermis hyper. and the okay. hyper. Okay. Or we do touch when we do micro needlings, okay. we yeah, for product penetration and mm-hmm. also when you're doing chemical peels mm-hmm. where you're exfoliating the skin trying mm-hmm. to help a person to look more aesthetically good mm. or better than she or he was So before. someone like me who has even tone, an even tone, tone face, so you can actually fix this? Yes, definitely. <laughs> we can Because by just me looking at you right now, mm-hmm. you your skin looks young, it looks healthy. However, there's pigmentation. Pigmentation could be caused maybe direct sunlight, you're not mm. using your sunscreen. Mm. It can also be like a hormonal, your diet, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. So we, we look at those things, like we we look at those things as well. Okay, mm. what causes the the, 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 the problem that you want to fix? Sure. You want to fix pigmentation. How do we fix it, you mm-hmm. know? So there's a dip for, for somatology, we going to work with your epidermis, mm a little bit of your dermis. So when you go to the doctor, coming to the difference between a doctor and the somatology, mm. the doctor, which will, in this case, would be the dermatologist. Dermatologist, yeah, sure, so sure. They are the more advanced. Mm. So they will go deeper into the skin. Mm. You know, they can even give you things to uh, take uh, internally. Mm-hmm. Yes. So there's a difference. So us, sometimes we're not allowed to do like surgery where we, let's say maybe you have like acne or okay, a breakout sure. where you want mm. like surgery we're mm. not allowed to like cut or open yes mm. but we do help mm. but for more advanced you would have to speak with the dermatologist so that's means- what we work hand in hand sometimes we even work together mm. with them yes so which means for someone who is like acne you can you can maybe suggest certain serums which you can put on your face that can help with that or do you have like uh, maybe a certain way that you touch? Because it seems like you guys, the way you, it's like you know the body, you know your way around the yes, body. Yes, yes. Is there certain techniques that you can touch to get that thing going or to go away? To go away. Um, it's, uh, as I said, it's diet. Mm. And oh, obviously diet genetics it, yeah. okay. as well, hormonal as well. Mm. So what caused your acne? So we need to get to the point what caused your acne. Okay. If it's something that can be changed, it's it's easy. It's, it's that's why I'm saying it, prevention. It's better than cure. Mm, <laughs> you sure, know that's sure. why we as a as a people we need to take care of our skins now, mm. and we do recommend like water, SPF. What's which that? is the SPF, it's like the sunscreen. Oh, okay, sure, sure, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, yeah. But now if you have acne, obviously if you come to ours, we can treat it. We mm. can treat it based on the on the products that we will give you mm. and obviously on the treatment that we can specialize for your acne. It, and it does... It does help. It does work. Mm. I've seen it a lot. Mm. Yes. So they can come to a salon, a spa, a wellness clinic, a resort. Uh, yeah, that's where you find 
qualified somatologist. Yes, we do help as okay. well with that. So you 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 are at CPT. So there's nothing that really surprised you besides uh, being there and loving. You just found yourself just loving everything that uh, they were doing there at uh, when you're studying. Uh, what okay? What was shocking is the number of uh, dropouts. You know some dropouts within the course sure. and how because I saw a trend and within the course where people we were like hey up well, they would ask us stand up introduce yourself uh, and then tell us why you chose this course each and every class when you go okay maybe this is a business practice class mm. a lecture comes in good morning okay so now I just want to know you better mm. uh, can anyone just introduce themselves and tell us why they chose somatology sure. and then you would find people said this was not my first choice <laughs> I was a walking <laughs> like, is this the rejects or the rejects comes <laughs> what happens here yeah. sure, yeah, sure, I was like shocked sure. like oh okay but yeah that's yeah that was shocking we, mm. I saw and then I saw people um, leaving the course you know what mm. I mean hey this is not for me that's why you need to have uh, the passion the for, passion for sure. it yes that's the sure. word yeah you need to have the passion for it and you need to see beyond uh, just pampering a mm. person because not just pampering the person okay <laughs> right yeah mm. so i think yeah people yeah that's what shocked me within the course and what also shocked me within the course but it changes now it changed now mm. is that it was only females or like, oh, okay. so is it only Is this a girl's course? I, I don't think no guy wants to do it. <laughs> yeah, but now, funny enough, yeah, sure. at CPUT, there are a few male therapists. Mm. Uh, yeah, yeah. And I can see that uh, men, I would love to see more men mm-hmm. in the course. But, uh, okay, while I was doing my in service training there was a, a one male therapist mm. obviously for men i understand why maybe they don't apply for the course it's because ish. No, it's, it doesn't seem like it. <laughs> to be honest it's not you. really men friendly yeah, it's, it's, not, it's, not, it's, it's like it's like a maleness it's, it's a rare species to find oh, like it's very hard to yes. find a maleness yeah but they are malenesses they are. but it's just something which is very hard to mm. actually find and and the just having to think of the idea of having to touch another human being. Mm. It feels like women are the, are the God-given. I don't want to feel sound uh, somehow, but yeah. it, it feels like women are very good in terms of having to take care of that part. Mm. But I think men, we, we, it sounds like we are a bit rough when I do the engineering and yeah. all the other stuff. Yeah, yeah I, think, I think you're right, but I think... I like to. I would love to see that change, okay. and I see a change that? in that uh, because men are as capable <laughs> as, as you are, <laughs> sure. and sometimes the clients maybe they want like a sports sports massage. Like okay, and what's deep, that? Deep, like that? sports is more like deep. You working in the muscle. Mm. You know, people who do bodybuilding, people oh, who, who, okay. who, who weight training, you know, mm. Th- mm. yeah, those, you know, the skin is hard. Mm. And then when you try to massage, you're like, yo, how am I going to uh, get into this knot? You know, because mm. it's deep within the muscle and there's sure. no like fat or the skin is, mm. you know, tight. So it gives for someone who's, as you said, men are more rough and mm. uh, yeah, you need those. Also, ads, do you get you know? those, kind of, that, those kind of challenges? Yeah, you get those kind of challenges. And then how do you deal with it? Luckily for us, we have like a cupping. So cupping, okay. yes, so obviously with massage, you use your hands, you use your forearms, mm. you use your elbows, mm. you yeah, you use your, <laughs> your your body weight as well. Mm. Yeah, but sometimes yeah, if you can't get your knees, yes. <laughs> <laughs> So in really we do like a body walk. That's where you use your knees, where you mm. do like a body walk. When you're just starting with your massage, mm. just working on top of the client. Sure. Just, and it cracks. If you do it properly, like the mm. back just cracks. Can and you do that thing where up. you make someone crack like their body? Yes, yes, yes. Can you do that? Yes. <laughs> nice. Sounds yes. cool. Yeah, really yeah, sounds it cool, is, yeah. it is, it is. And it, it is relaxing, it's mm. relieving, and it's... Yeah, it's, it's, it's cool. I have a question for you, but I think yes. I'll leave it for later. For later, all right. right. <laughs> you can bring it now. <laughs> Check it now. I want to ask yes. for you being um, able to do uh, this yes. work, yeah. right? Do you feel like um, you would want someone to be able to do it the same for you? Like, let's oh. say if you had a partner, you would want someone to do the same thing. 
like the same the same experience you have yes you'd also want someone to be able to do do it to, to do you the as well. same mm. like at home or at work at when home i book or at work or whatever uh i think maybe with most therapists i don't think it's it's a me thing i i, I mm. think but obviously we know like how your way a proper home. massage mm. should feel like okay Okay. Let's say maybe you're not a person who does regular massages mm. or you don't give regular massages. Mm-hmm. A person can faff and they can get away with it. They can just maybe apply a few effralages mm. and then you're there, oh, please, oh, this is nice. <laughs> and then they can get away with it, you know? Sure, sure. But now if you know, hey, this person didn't even touch my scalpula, mm. they didn't focus on this muscle, mm. and you're, you're there waiting for it, hey, is he going to do <laughs> <laughs> Is he going to take my arm and twist it so sure. I can work like underneath mm, my, mm. you know? And then you're waiting like, hey, this person, I'm not feeling the person, yeah. you know, it happens. So so which mm. means you guys, when you go, let's say if you go for a, for a massage yes. yourself, do you, you kind of like, do you kind of like rate the person who's actually doing you a massage? You kind of like rate them? Do you rate, do you rate them? Like as they're, as they're giving you a massage, like do you rate how mm. they are actually giving you the, the massage? Um, it depends. It depends. Let's say when you when you your body is tight, mm. right, and you need to be worked out, mm. like those knots. You want like a, a result driven treatment. Mm. You want to feel the results, like yo, oh, at least my body. But when you're just going there, because sometimes you can book a massage just for re- relaxation. Mm. Let's say maybe you and you and your wife went mm. like for like a massage, you know. So and that was a time for relaxation, sure. like for like just just pampering, you know. Mm. So there, you're not like you even listening to the to the to the music, yes. the ambience, mm. the tone. You just just think just of your enjoy. own enjoying it, sure, you know. Sure. So yeah, they can do like nice strokes. You do, you don't mind, mm. but there are points where like, hey, now I, I'm booking this because I'm fixing this problem, mm. you know. So that's where therapists should understand are you here for complete relaxation mm. or is there anything that you want to achieve from your treatment oh, that's I where see. consultation comes in mm. that you need to consult mm. with your with your <laughs> with your uh, client because yeah. uh, people visit for different reason the reason the way i maybe i can book you for a firm pressure today i want something like mm. deep tissue strong massage mm. put stones put everything you know okay. the following okay. day like i'm just here for relaxation mm-hmm. and you're just to unwind to really stress and yeah so always ask uh, yeah. I, I, th- I think we might have just got ahead of ourselves a little bit is it <laughs> <laughs> but i wanted to ask maybe this last question just yes. before we get to the actual work that you do right yeah is how how do you pass or how do you excel in somatology or how did you excel in somatology in class mm. to get to a point where you actually graduate like you said there's mm. a lot of um uh, people who drop out yeah, who get to a, a who get to a point where they don't actually fall, fall in love with the actual mm. trade of yeah. somatology so how do you do it uh, so that you can just advise someone school mm. um obviously yo the, the somatology course was uh, child. It, people thought it was easy, okay. you know, because like ah, you guys are just learning, you know. They didn't know that. Yay, hey, Charlie, we do like sure. like the subjects, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like the subjects were very challenging. I don't want to lie. So mm. it needed you to 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 work and to understand. So what helped me to complete the course and to graduate, uh, it was like like studying, you know and understanding mm. because the we did nine nine modules and there's a practical there are two practicals okay. you know so yeah it, it it needed you to to tell yourself that i'm gonna pass mm. <laughs> you know yeah sure, yeah because yeah. Sure. yeah i i had to tell myself that i'm gonna pass but mm. obviously i didn't I think I, I failed my second year, funny enough. Mm. Not that I was dumb or anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I felt my second year, I felt anatomy and I also felt nutrition. Okay. You know, yeah. But 
it was a point it was when i was doing my in service training but that failure i took it as a learning curve mm. you know mm. that now i'm just doing two sub because i only did two subjects also oh, you were doing practicals and the two subjects that you were doing yeah okay, sure. that was when i was doing my in service training mm. so it helped me to to focus more at work as mm. well because i was only just doing two mm. and then i uh, i learned more in that mm. year mm. yeah yeah i think that's 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 quite cool because mm. Um the purpose of this podcast is mm. just to at least try to help someone who's either doing somatology or mm. who's actually practicing and have to get to know the different techniques that you guys work with mm. and I'm 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 some form of a mediator who mm. tries to just ask the right questions as yes, much yes, as yes. possible mm. and um this gets to you working yeah you get to work the first time the first day yeah um how is that like and what are you doing Uh so I like somatology a lot because especially CPUT mm-hmm. it offers us that uh, e-learning is it work is it learning like your hours yeah. what do, what do they call your hours when you're doing your hours Oh is it is it the one where you you work at, on campus uh uh-uh, you work for for us maybe it's different with different maybe departments, different with departments yes. yeah. but with somatology like on your second year mm-hmm. like around about october november or august mm. somewhere they okay so now it's close to the season where they you go for your, your in service training. training yeah yes, the yes. word is in service training yes yes <laughs> it's been yes. a while okay, yes, yeah thanks for me in service training yeah sure sure so you go for in service training mm. yeah so for me I was like okay I'm doing an in service okay we have to go for an in service training. Sure. And then I I liked uh I don't know if you know the Southern Sun Strand Street. You said no. So big hotel. Yeah the big hotel mm-hmm. in town. Ooh. See here. <laughs> sure. I always like used to see myself working with the best devil. Mm. Obviously if I'm doing this course mm. at least touch the best. <laughs> Sorry to say but yo. Sure. Like it you know at least I would sure. be I'll be mm. touching them, you know. Mm. So I'm like, hey, at least there. Yeah, let me apply for this one, you know. Yeah. So for me, what helped me, it was uh, I wrote it down mm. that I want to work for the Southern Sign. Okay. Like, um, <laughs> I believe in in, in prayer. I'm sorry, mm. but I I believe in prayer. Hey, don't be sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I yeah. prayed for that uh, that. Um, that in service yeah because there, there was mm. a lot of us mm. and other people also wanted southern sun and mm. they can only maybe take one or two but there's a lot of spas in cape town there's mm. a lot of you know, there's a lot of spas shems our oh, somatology yeah. it's, it's it's growing yeah. the, the the beauty field it's you will never be out without job because sure. there's a lot you can even open your own mm. like yeah there's a lot I so like that. <laughs> so sure. i just wrote it down that i want this mm. and then obviously when i saw that big building like oh mm. my workplace yeah so this other time i forgot i was working with a friend like oh there's my work oh, they took you already I'm like oh not yet but <laughs> so in, <laughs> so, so yeah i was do, speaking yeah. it into existence mm. yeah and then funny enough on the day i was wearing a short skirt yellow mm. with a nice top but i was like yellow as if, as if i'm not going for an interview but i mm. think something uh, a thought came into my mind let me just go for this uh, mm. interview and apply for the work mm. uh il was this work was in service training in service training yeah sure. so I, like let me apply so i went there with the, so they asked me you know what the port is out mm. uh, so they asked oh what are you here for i'm here for the spa so they thought maybe i have an, a spa appointment mm. Mm. Like, i'm from the interview so they joke like this code like interview <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure. Sure. so right mm. so apparently there was a manager there like oh, we're not taking any people but like hey, but I prayed for this job mm, like god mm. where are you mm. <laughs> they're like not taking any people for this in service training but um let me just wait a minute let me just call and find my manager my husband okay. like, a manager has a manager like yeah, yeah, call this, my, my manager. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and ask maybe you might be like so yeah. she called same day said yes i got an interview this the, the same day and then there's a trade trade test where they okay. see how you apply the polish Oh okay. How you do your waxing mm-hmm. <laughs> and then your back massage, how you do afrology and everything if mm. you, if you have the the the, the skill. So so it, before you go to uh for in service training, you they you is, must have you have to do you, do you learn how to do those things? Yeah, so our somatology department mm. it has a wellness clinic. Mm. 
Mm. So within your first year, mm. that's where you do your practicals in your first year. Oh, I see. So you do that's why okay. it's a lot of work. People who drop up because they can't. You have to work mm. and also theory Study, part as well. Yes, yeah. Yes, yes, so yes. in first year, we used to do on each other. So mm. I'm the model, and then you are the client. It was nice. It was fun. I enjoyed that. Yes, like, oh, yes. I'm going to class. They're gonna paint my nails. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna wax my sure, underarms. Wax, you yeah, know what I mean? Sure, sure. Yeah, it was nice. So you guys, you had your nails done throughout. Uh, yeah, but obviously painting, it's not allowed. So, oh, okay, sure, yeah, sure. You, you, know, you don't paint, but obviously practicing, yeah, mm, you, then you mm. have to remove it again. Okay. And then the waxing and then the massage. So we used to practice on each other. Okay. So then okay. on your second year when you're going, uh, so the, 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 the clinic, it's for practicing for each other. Mm -hmm. It's also for the community. So people would oh, book. Oh, I see. So a massage would be very affordable. So mm. even now you can book yourself. Then the students. The students, they practice on you. <laughs> they practice on you there. But they, yeah. Must others, be nice though. Yeah, because sure. it's extremely affordable. Mm, Maybe mm, for, f yeah, yeah, it's extremely affordable. Okay. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's just, because sure, they're, sure. they're practicing, you know what I mean? Okay. So you practice on each other, mm. and then we also practice on the community. So which means basically you were ready for that. We are ready for the for insert, interview. Yeah. So yeah. that's why when they say paint, oh, your application is neat. Oh, so so is so I just wanted I just want you to just explain it nicely uh, so that we can just see the the actual picture, right? So yeah. you, you get there and then they give you that opportunity to actually do the interview and actually do it. So why are you doing it on on the late? Okay, so the lady said, "Um, I'm sorry, we're not taking any people at the moment." Mm. So I just sulk a bit, like, "Yo, God, where are you?" Mm. You know. So I just stand there and stood and wait and looked at her. Mm. So she was like, okay, wait, uh, let me just call uh, my manager and find mm. out. Mm. So she called the manager and then the manager was like, I don't know what she said to her, but she came with the message or the response. Like, okay, mm. so it's fine. And then then they, we did the in, like the trade test. The trade test, so okay. So they took me, so we so did the trade test it on, on her. Or on, on the her. manager? Yes, on okay, the manager. Okay, so okay. I painted her, mm. did her waxing, I think, and the back massage. Okay. Yeah, and then she was happy, and then she told me when to start. Mm. Yeah. And, and so you were just impressed on the first day? Yes. <laughs> I didn't go alone. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't knew that I was not there alone. Yeah, yeah that was yeah. nice. That mm. was nice. So to anyone maybe who's listening to this, I don't know, mm. I just, yeah. Yeah, and sometimes we, not just to focus on your skill only, because mm. skill only or your, it will fail, mm. you know, yeah, just, just to say that. <laughs> just no, to I, say I, that, I yeah. Because like, sometimes, really like oh, <laughs> mm. you'll think you've got this kind, they're like, no, <laughs> you know they, what I mean? Yeah. Like you, yeah, sure. yeah, 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 so the industry, yeah, you, you so, need to have a backup. So, so you start working, right? Mm. You're starting to I work. I start working with yes. them, yeah. So that means... Um, I just want you to just explain the different uh, types of massages mm. and the types of uh, stuff that you do. I heard you talking about uh, for exfoli or oh, exfoliation. Is it exfoliation? Yeah. So those are, it's for the facials. But you said something. The uh, floss. I, I just want you to explain because I, okay. I didn't really follow some of the stuff that you said. I just wanted to explain. So what are you doing on your day to day, and then what are the different departments which are there in somat somatology, and mm -hmm. then we can just break it down for us as well, as well. just in detail, so that case someone who's listening to this can say, okay, okay, maybe I like this, and maybe mm -hmm. you can also explain in terms of, do you can you actually specialize? Like, okay, I'm the when it comes mm -hmm. to massages, I'm the I'm the best. Oh yes, yes, you know, yes. You know I mean? So okay. I just want you to just explain the different um, uh, departments which are there in uh, okay. somatology. Okay, departments. Um, okay, let's. Okay, can I break it down this way, right? Okay. Okay, as the field as a whole. Yeah, well, okay. I'm gonna start and then I'm gonna come down. Sure. Okay, so as a field as a whole, uh, somatology is a field, mm. right? So you get okay where you get to work. I'm gonna start where you get to work, right? Mm. So you can work at the salon. For me, salons are. Yeah, it's more like result driven. Like okay. when you go to a salon, mm -mm -mm. you know, when you go to a salon, it's mainly like uh, for facials, for trading, mm. for your waxing. Trading. trading, yeah. It's like they, they use like a, a, a tread mm -hmm. to, to remove. It's a form of uh, hair removal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they're shaping your brows. You know, it's for the okay. brows mainly. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Then you want to do eyelash, permanent eyelash extensions. Mm. So there's even now um, uh, microdermabrasion. 
where it's like inkish. Is it micro braiding? Mic- yeah, micro braiding. Sorry, <laughs> I don't, okay. yeah, yeah, mm. that one. It's more mm. like uh, like. Permanent. I see the one that looks very nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's nice. It's sure, nice. Sure. So those are done in more like uh, salons, mm, you know, like when okay. you, yeah. Because if you go to the spa and you want to book for those, like, mm. um, yeah, I want to book for lash extensions, you might not find them. So those are, are salons mm. where it's more like Specifically aesthetics. On the beauty it's side It's more of beauty okay, and more sure, the aesthetics sure. of the, yes. So yes. which means things like nails, nails, pedicure, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah do so they will do like yeah. if you want like more like. Do you guys do makeup? Makeup, yeah. You study makeup. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, you study makeup on your first year. Mm. Then you do it for like a test. Like you do, you do it like you study it like the history of it as well. You study the history of it as well, and then you there's a course in us. It, cosmetology mm. so cosmetology is like this, you have to study like uh, the ingredients we, we study the ingredients of uh it's makeup. In, of makeup yeah, yeah of yeah, any sure. products because mm. we deal with product houses mm. so let's say maybe there's a certain product house let's say a demologica for an example mm. there's environ and then they want to introduce their brand to the spa because it's only spa certain spa products that you won't find at your pick and pays at mm, your woolies but it's I only found in yeah, yeah sure. so us we study the 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 the, 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 the ingredients the active mm, ingredients okay. what does this ingredient do to to a product mm. that's why we even went uh, and had like where we make our own soaps make our own hand creams at sure, school yeah sure. it's Knowing the ingredients is very important. Okay. So you can bring any products, but mm. if you say this ingredient, you know you must know at least what this it. Is the result that yeah, it, it gives. You, you know sure, what I mean? Sure. Yeah. So it's 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 more in depth than mm. the surface only. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. So for the salons, that's what you deal with, like mm. more like uh, aesthetics, aesthetics yeah, yeah. side of, of sure. yes. Or you can go for spas. Spas, it's where it deals with the. With more massages, it's like resorts. People book because of it's their honeymoon. Mm. They flying over to Cape Town. Like, oh, first thing, I'm tired. Mm. It's been a long flight. Jet I want to go. Yeah. Even, yes, <laughs> yay! Americans, they like that one. I'm jet sure. lag. I want to book for a massage. You sure, know, sure. you go there mm. or um, wellness clinics. Okay. As well, where they also result driven, mm. where they work maybe with the dermatologist as well. Sure. Yeah, yeah, and then you can also if you do your B tech, but now it's not B tech anymore. It's an advanced diploma, diploma yeah, so it, yeah. it's more or less the same. It mm. can it can afford you to 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 be a beauty educator. You okay. can be a lecturer as well. I know there are about like five. Uh, TUTs mm. or universities of technology rather mm. that do offer somatology course okay. and there's a, a lot of course of, of, of um what's this colleges out there okay. which offers even though it's the not somatology side, but yeah, the beauty sure. side you beauty can side things, you, you yeah. can be a beauty educator mm. so it's it's it, it you can work on the cruise with the with the course oh, travel yeah, sure, the world sure, travel, <laughs> yeah, sure, it's sure. nice you know mm. what I mean and obviously staying there for free you're mm. just traveling and then you can so go in different destinations. De- destination, yeah, sure, but you sure. do the same thing as you do at uh, at the spa, because mm. in the cruise they own like spas, so sure, it's like you're working at the yeah. five star spa. Mm-hmm. So yeah, if you can, if you like sales and marketing, and uh, so you can work for product where, product houses mm. where you go to ask the spas, mm. and then you it's like you're selling the the product so that the product space that that um are required by the spas like you said yes yes yes, yes, yes. Okay, so you're working sure. for them mm. so if let's say maybe you're working for a certain product mm. and then they cater for spas mm. so you it's like you are they are I forgot the word <laughs> sorry uh, uh, marketing a rep marketing. they call them rep okay yeah something okay. like yeah they're they're rep sure so you go and then mm. obviously you mm. open the groups for the therapist mm-hmm. you assist the therapist you make sure there is stock for them mm. so it's more you're more on your feet you are you're a sales oh, rep for them so you're not just job, yeah. massaging mm. only so you can be on the education you can be on uh, research mm. a beauty um, a beauty what do you call this a beauty journalist or editor 
Oh, yeah. I see. So what you mean. right. Yeah. Sure. It's it's broad. It's it's beautiful. It's, broad, it's big. Yes. It's big. It's yeah. nice. You can own own your own. <laughs> mm. You know, be a manager. <laughs> yeah, that's where I'm tapping. Anyone yeah. who's listening. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. My partners um, are listening. Uh, so yeah. So I, so that means you were just explaining the the somatology in. in yeah, the, the, that the what you can do you within can the do. field. Yeah, it's broad. And, it's and I think I like that because at least it gives an idea in terms of which. Where can um, you fit? Where would you like exactly. to see yourself? So in? which means you chose the spa side of things. Oh, right? love it, love it. <laughs> yeah, it's and, nice. Uh, uh, and then, so what? What are you guys doing inside the spa? Inside the spa. Yes, the, like just if you get to as much detail as possible, mm. I would love that. Uh. It's good that I know that you know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I can't lie. <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> yeah. In the spa, so the ease like it can be a, uh, okay. Okay. I do as well. Most therapists do like uh, spa reception work duties. Okay. Where you can be booked. Like oh, now at this hour, mm. <laughs> you have to cover desk, you know, mm. you have to sort out emails, you have to respond to emails. So like you are the face of the, of, of, of the spa, sure, you know, sure. people, when they're coming in, you opening the door for them, you allow them to sit down mm. there write their consultation cards. Because normally most spas, they have like facilities. So some people, they're not even there for the actual treatment, but they're there for facilities. Mm -hmm. Most spas offers like the saunas, the steam room, flotation tanks, uh, heated pools. So people, they are there to just go relax. In their facilities. Rejuvenate, yeah, yeah, sure, unwind, sure. you know, mm -hmm. just connect with their inner being. Come on. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> and it smells like... Nice, mm. the ambience, the tone, yeah. you know. Yeah. It's like it's like a second heaven. Mm. Come on. <laughs> a paradise. <laughs> Spa is amazing. That's why people and go there. I yeah. guess that's that's the point. To get people who are coming trying mm. to get out of the normal way of doing yeah. that, to get to a point where you can just relax and mm. just forget about your problems. And funny enough, mm -hmm. the numbers has increased. The numbers have of, increased. Of people coming. Yeah, post two thousand and eighteen, like nineteen. Okay till now where there was restrictions like mm. a lot of people didn't come but after the restriction has been lifted like mm. yo the the business like flew it's like the bombing. numbers it's bombing like hey sure. people needed the touch mm. or others they with when when you are withholding a lot within you and you mm. just want just someone to hold you someone mm. go to relax and mm. yeah the numbers have grown a lot interesting yeah i was like what Okay. <laughs> that sounds interesting. Right? Yeah, sure. that, yeah, that was yeah. a shock. You know, that was a okay. shock that, yeah, people, yeah, coming through. <laughs> which is good, which is good, yeah. It's good for, you, for you guys. For like us. Business, yeah. Business. And, and for the and people as well, because they keep coming, which means it's working. Whatever it is, okay. it's working. <laughs> <laughs> sure, sure. It's working. Man. Sure. It's, 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 it's so, so what else are you doing um, in, in, in the spas? In the spa. So, yeah. okay. We spoke about the reception side of yeah. it. Uh, so then there's treatments mm. that you do. So now you're a spa yeah. therapist. Yeah. You do treatments. So treatments, facials, as we've spoken. Uh, so there are different types of facials, different okay. types of massage. You can just explain that. I just want you to explain as, as much as possible okay. if you can. Because it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a spa. Mm -hmm. So our facials are not advanced. Okay. Where we do like deep stuff. Because mm -hmm. people, they don't, our most booked treatment was is massages rather than facials. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we do advance, but not, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you do your 30 minutes express facial mm -hmm. or your full facial. Okay. And then yeah. is it the, the part where you're just checking, scraping out the, the dead the skin? The dead skin, yes, yes, okay. yes, 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 yes. Oh, I think for, for me, it's like people should know their their face yeah, well, know your yeah, well, <laughs> know your face mm -hmm. or your skin rather okay because okay, they're different like there's an oily skin mm -hmm. dry skin oh, okay, combination sure. skin like mm -hmm. know your skin type okay yeah, well, and know the the products to, Which you, to use yeah because yeah. yeah. we as a therapist i don't want a person to have an oily skin or a dry skin mm -hmm. you want it to be normal mm. you know what i mean so it should be like normal so we avoiding because if it's oily you're prone to like 
breakouts. Mm. If it's too dry, you are prone to premature aging where mm. you see like, hey, the fine lines, you know, yeah. Oh, so at I least see. if it's like, okay. it should be mm. balanced. Even okay. your, even with the body, mm. we don't want you to be... Avoid. No. <laughs> It's not about weight. You don't need a fitness instructor here. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If you are overweight, you can still come. It's fine. Mm. We'll, we'll, you guys yeah. know, you know we, how to find the, mus- <laughs> the muscles in the fat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we, we work with soft tissues. I think a, mu- mm. a fat is a soft tissue. Oh, okay. You know, the okay. muscle is a fat tissue. Mm. The tendons... You know, mm. the, yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, yeah, so we, it's like we're manipulating the releasing the, 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 the stress, okay. improving your circulation. So which means, so you're saying that stress, because um, mm. I wanted to get to touch on the, the spiritual side of, of mm. your work. Yeah. Because it seems like there is a spiritual side of it as yes, well, right? Yes, yes, there is. So, okay, maybe let me just pause this question. <laughs> Let's finish up the, the things that you do in the spa. In the then spa. we can just move in into the spiritual side of your okay. of the kind of work you do. Okay, yeah. so, yeah, you you do your facials every... if Okay, so you have... Okay, when you're booking, or we, the spas are different. Mm. So you have to check their menu, what they offer. Or what do they offer, Yeah, sure. sometimes they don't offer... It's because uh, people will be like... Yeah, this girl, she's missing this. Mm. But I'm just speaking with the spa that I work for. Mm. You know, yeah. Sure. And then, so you can be an assistant mm. even or a supervisor, but you're still doing therapies, okay. therapy work or treatments. Sure. And then I think only for manager where you don't necessarily have to do treatments. Treatments, okay. Yeah. And then an owner. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so um, the um, the work that you're doing. So that means I just want to understand. Mm. So that means there's facial and there's down down the body. Down the body. Yes. So that's what you do in the spa, right? Yes, correct. So which means um, things like waxing. So you got mm. waxing and you got massages, mm. uh, foot massage. Do you do mass- foot massage as well? Yes, yes. So I just wanted you to explain those stuff in terms of the different ones that you have. And that you do, so that case, I can just have an idea. Okay, this is so that even me when I'm coming to book, I just know. Okay, I'm just coming for my facial this yeah. time around, or I guess coming for uh, like re- I think what the other time I was talking to you, you're talking about reflex, uh, reflexology. Refle- reflexology yeah. is it reflexology. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. So just I just want you to explain those those things so that case we can just have an idea of um, what you mm. guys are doing. Okay, so for the full body massage, mm-hmm. there's a different massages you do. Mm. So, Swedish. Okay. <laughs> but for us, we don't do Swedish. Okay. Do you, do you, are you expected to know it? Hmm? Are you Swedish, I know, to... yeah. Okay. So, we know different types of, of yeah. massages. I want you to explain those different types okay. of massages. I'm not going to explain what I'm, I'm doing. I'm just going to explain the different types of massages. Okay, sure, sure, sure. sure okay. Sure. So, there is a, a Swedish. Okay. A Swedish massage. Mm-hmm. And then there is uh, maybe the Indian aromatherapy massage. Okay. And then what, what, what are you, what do you, what are you doing at the Swedish? Swedish, the only difference, it would be the oils. Oh, the different The oils. rhythm. Okay. And then uh, the technique. Mm. Yeah, that's the difference. Okay. So for the Swedish, Swedish is more like uh, relaxing. Yeah. And then when it's aromatherapy massage, it's more about the essential oils. Mm. You know, oils are very important when it comes to massages. Yes, because they give or they, they can, they do the work. Mm. By itself, most of the times, mm. the yeah, it depends which oil you're using, mm. what you wanna achieve for mm. the client. Okay. And then uh, there is a uh, hot stone therapy, hot stone as well because of the warmth of the stone in the muscle, so it heats up the muscle, creating that vasodilation, so it can work deeper into the knot, you know. Yeah, and the enormous warmth, what it does to the muscles. Yes, so there's a hot stone therapy. And then there is uh, the heated pouches. So I don't know, it, it depends with each company. Mm. Some practices, they put like salt. Mm. 
okay. and some herbs inside, mm. and then they heat it up, and then they do like a, a technique where they apply okay. it into your soul muscles. Mm. Uh, there's there's different there's a sports massage, deep mm. tissue, okay. uh, lomi lomi, uh, chiatsu. Mm. Uh, I like chiatsu. <laughs> is it? Mm. <laughs> Thai massage, I don't really know it that much. I've thigh. seen it, yeah. Tea. Are you just doing the, the thigh, the actual thigh? Uh-uh. We lay down. Okay. Oh, is it Thai? Sorry. <laughs> yes. Okay, okay, yes, sure, sure. Thai massage. Okay. <laughs> yeah, what else? <laughs> Thigh, tie. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I mean like with... Oh, yeah, yeah with, tie massage. Yeah, yeah sure, so, sure, so sure, I sure. don't even know it, but yeah. Sure. Yeah. And then, yeah. Then there's a foot massages mm. where we do the reflexology. Sure. And maybe normal foot massage. Mm. Yeah. And then there is your brooming nail, nail. Mm. Yeah. Because for me, it's it's important where you do your nails, you know what I mean? Okay. Because yeah. I was once I like that, there yeah. at, in town mm. to do my hair. Sometimes must be braided there. The, I'm not going to also... mention. Not going to mention. Oh, yeah, the... <laughs> you mean your own places that you go to. There, okay. There's a place in town. Maybe <laughs> sure. people know. Mm. But there is a place like in town. I was mm. so, but not these braids. My mm. previous. Yeah, I once did my braids. Okay. Hair. And then the chomis. Mm. I don't, I don't want to mention. But I understand. I understand what you. <laughs> you know, when you hear a therapist and you see sure. people like, ah. <laughs> sure. You know, sure. yeah. Sure. So the way you know, what's the file? File. Oh yeah, file. the file. Yeah, the yes, file. Yes, 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 yes. It's for shaping. Mm. Once you cut, mm-hmm. then you shape with then the file. Yes, yeah, I you shape with yeah, the file. Yeah, sure, sure. And then they took the file because mm. the file have ra- the, it's, it's a bit, a bit of rough, yeah, because yes, yes, it yes. cuts a bit. Mm, mm. Even if you don't want to cut, you can just use the file to sure. cut. So they take the file, they buff, they nail bed. I was like, God, this person, <laughs> you're shading off your nail bed, so your nail mm. is going to be very thin. Mm. You know, yeah, so they were like uh, buffing with that, hard buffing. Mm. So when you know that, you, when you're a therapist and you're not like, hey, but this you're not supposed it's to extreme, do like, yeah, yeah sure, sure, it's sure. extreme. And then because mm. you're going to apply it, acrylic over there and mm. then it's going to damage the nail when a person is removing the nail bed is very mm. thin and then, okay, yeah i see what you mean and then yeah. the hygiene as well mm. because obviously when you push back the cuticles you're nipping mm. and then you take the same nip that someone <laughs> has like oh, you know you're just cringing like yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. so, so in, we in, do in a sense, grooming as well yeah yeah. Hygiene it was very important at school. Mm. Yeah, well, so it's something. <laughs> <laughs> it's important when you do this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So like, you know, it's like, hey, hygiene, guys. Sure. Yeah, it's, sure. It's, yeah. I think that's quite and interesting. Safety of the, the mm. person. It's not about the money, mm. but also the person's safety. You know what I mean? We want, them, we want to make them look beautiful, mm. but main, it's not about just maybe hygienic, hygienic wise yeah. and treating. Mm. Treatment is more than just. Maybe aesthetic or just painting or making oh the acrylic itself, yeah. but the actual nail is damaged. That mm. we don't want that. Protect the the actual nail, and then we can add like more aesthetics on top. Yeah, but knowing that your actual, imagine now you look nice when you remove. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> you know, it's sad. Sure. So sure, yeah, it's something sure. that we should. Or be woke when it comes to your mm. nails and protect. Yeah, interesting. And, yeah, and then uh, and then uh, I just want to get to this part of um, the the spas, right? Mm. Spas can be very intimate, and mm. um, you work with different people and different characters and different I don't know different backgrounds. Yeah. Um, does it get awkward uh, sometimes when you're working with a client or the, the client is just a uh, just requesting things which you don't want, you, you're mm-hmm. not keen, or they don't know that this is the product that you guys don't do. So how is it like? Because yeah, I think now it, now things changed. To be honest with you, when mm. I started, sorry, I was shocked. Okay. Like, yay, yay, yay. Am I even in the right? Do people know that I studied for this? <laughs> I went to school. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> this is yeah. Do they do they know that I three years? You mm. know, four because I failed. Four. Mm. <laughs> do they do, do they know? Mm. Oh, and, 
So I was like, I yeah. At first, at first, yeah, it was it was challenging. Mm. It was challenging in rays. In at rays. Oh, okay, sure, 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 at sure, rays, sure. Yeah. Mm. So at rays, um, someone approached me. Like, hey, this girl is doing it. so I told it. I think guys as well. I think because there was <laughs> <laughs> this girl is doing so I tell you. Sure. It was like, do you mind practicing on my back? Okay. I'm going to pay you. <laughs> oh, so the guy. He yeah, said the guy says he's going to pay. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. But practicing, because we, we used to love practicing, right? Because mm, mm. you're going to get marked. Mm. When, so the teacher can say, this girl, she knows the sequence. Mm, mm. Like, oh, definitely. And you're going to pay. Mm. So in a bonus. And you guys, I mean, if you're a student, you're thinking, this is another way of action making. Making a business. It's a business. I'm like, oh, yeah, sure, sure. Okay. These, mm. uh, let me test my entrepreneurial skills here. Mm. Something is cooking here. Sure. <laughs> Let me go for it. Yeah. <laughs> Little did I know. <laughs> but guy and mm. his old minds, you know what I mean? Yeah. So I was like, oh, there was my first wake up call ever. When some when something like that happened. Like, is is it like a very serious incident where you had to like run? Run. For, run away? I had to like run away and push the person. Are you serious? Because we did the the treatment. Mm. But funny enough, because I was maybe stupid. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. But I did it at his room. But I was still young and mm, mm. a child. Naive, but yeah. Yeah, sure, yeah. Sure. And I'm trying to figure... Of, I'm very sorry for that. Yeah. <laughs> trying to figure this thing. Mm, <laughs> like, mm. Obviously, you don't think. You go to their room. Mm. You know, and then he's going to sleep in his bed. Mm. Obviously. Half naked. <laughs> mm, sure, <laughs> If sure. I may say. Mm. Because his top is out. Yeah, yeah. And then you practice. And it was like, we just... Practicing, okay, mm. this is the fralage. Oh, they even call us the technique. Oh, now I'm working along the spine. Okay, the sure. Sacrum, so sure. I was doing my thing. Mm. All of a sudden, person break up. like, hey. <laughs> 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 Thank sure. you so much. Wants to give me a hug. I thought, okay, it was a hug. Mm. But like, hey, what's happening now? The mm. person is has changed. Mm, mm. I was like, maybe my hands were too, maybe, I don't know. So you feel, you feel like, Oh, so you actually questioning yourself. What's, yeah, what's now, happening? Yeah, now, is it me? Yeah, is it sure, me? Sure. So you feel like, is it me? Was I touching like too mm. light? Was I supposed to go too deep? Mm. Yep. That was my first like wake up call or incident. Like, mm. the, uh -uh, this thing is, but I didn't say anything like to anyone. Or, like, mm. you know, but at least didn't do anything. But like, hey, it could have been like could something. Been yeah, 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 I was sure. everything. Because sure. yeah, it, you know, it shut me Mm. Off and but how did you deal with it? Mm? How do you deal with it? How do you recover from that? How do you recover from that? From yourself, because uh -huh. I, I don't think that's a normal thing. How how do you still like have the same passion of wanting to still continue with somatology, even though After, you have had uh, an encounter like that? I don't know. Maybe I, I thought it's part of the. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like something that we just brush it off. Yeah, like, so yeah once, I think one one in a. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I just yeah, I brushed it off like mm. okay, it's not gonna maybe it's not gonna happen again. I don't sure. know. But obviously, when a person asks you maybe, what are you studying? They're like somatology. Mm. Oh yeah, pota potos. <laughs> then that's where it comes back to that thing. Sure. Oh maybe pota potos are this thing. <laughs> so sure, I was sure, I was at the sure. point where I didn't want to tell people that I was studying somatology. Sure. You know, sure. Because they it's going to refer back to that and mm. pota pota also. Sure. Yeah, but so, hey, uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and then it worked when I was doing the place where I told you about the Southern Sign. Sure. Where I was doing my in-service training. Mm. That's where you got like another incident, yeah, but, mm. where you massaging your client and then you see like the hands. Okay? That goes to the knee. Yeah, yeah. And then he... he you let go and you see you're not comfortable or you're pulling back or mm, you're stopping mm, 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 then you say the scale is not un it's uncomfortable mm. and then you do your thing again mm. then you see the hand hey, what's <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm like sorry sir if you touch me again mm. I will have to stop the treatment and you'll pay the full price for the treatment sure then he's like yo this girl is serious mm. and then he like takes out money like big money mm. <laughs> and at that time I didn't have like Mm. But you're still like a student because I told you myself I was sure. doing my in service while I was doing. So you're just finishing with your study. Yeah, I, mean, I was just doing the, the two. Yeah, sure. I think mm. it was the following year. I was just doing the two yeah. and just working. I was mainly mm. working. So like, oh, so the guy I'm is saying, offering you yeah, money, he's giving money. Like, mm. so I'm last, like giving me money for mm. what? Mm. Maybe for it's those. But did I tell? 
I took the money. I don't mm. want to lie. <laughs> mm. Okay. <laughs> okay. I took the money, mm. but but he didn't do anything. Mm. I think he didn't do anything. Mm. Only after, mm. only after when you turn around, mm. you know, like I I gave you something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he actually wanted the money back. I didn't want the money back. I didn't give him the money back, but you only after when you turn around. Because mm. I was gonna do the, the front side. Okay. Because the money was there. Like he gave them but in well, he gave it ne? Mm. and then put it there. Mm. And then he we, I did the treatment mm. and then when you turn around. Then you wanted to do the the the, the dates. Thigh. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, and then obviously you're gonna some that but we didn't we don't do the baby thing. So obviously when you're doing the thighs, it's like, can you do the other area? Mm, mm. Like, uh uh-uh, we don't do the other area. Mm. You know? Even the thighs, we don't go too up. Yeah. Know? And then he's like, I gave you something. <laughs> <laughs> like, I gave you something. <laughs> yeah, that's why I saw like, yeah, I've seen last day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, what? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then... Yeah. I didn't, but I didn't do it. I remember I didn't do it. Mm-hmm. And then I continued to do the arms. Mm-hmm. And then I do the other arm, do the decollete. Do, do you get and to then, a point where you kind of like, you you just switch off like, okay, sir, I'm just going to leave now. Uh, mm-hmm. Do you get to a point, do you get to that point where you actually just say, I, the things are just getting out of control since you, it's like you're not getting into your mind that I don't want to do this other Stuff. Uh, I haven't mm. gotten to that point to because like they that, haven't right? pushed to that point. Mm. That's the thing. I think okay. they're also doing it mm. with fear because oh. obviously it's a big hotel. There's securities. Mm. I can just, the door is open. I can just jump it. Hey, this person is doing this thing to me. Mm. And then obviously they'll be in big, you know. Mm. So obviously they don't push towards that limit, but mm. they test in you because other oh, girls sure. would easily do, so the other you know, they actually do it. maybe I'm not I don't know. Okay, sure, sure. <laughs> maybe. Okay, <laughs> but, okay. you know, maybe other girls would, would do. So they mm. think, oh, maybe you went somewhere else mm. and then you think you're going to get this. So now you're testing, okay, to see are they going to oh, okay. touch me or sure, are they going to, sure, you know sure. what I mean? Yeah. It's 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 few where you get those ins- mm. incidents. incidents yeah. yeah. It's few. For me, it's the res thing mm. and that. One encounter. Yeah, that one encounter. Mm. And then others would do it maybe verbally mm. but they won't like touch mm. you back yeah they'll do it like verbally so it's like flirting sort of yeah. verbally. verbally maybe they'll ask or oh, just to ask you yeah so you guys do you do happy ending what happy do you call ending? it happy, happy endings okay happy endings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they ask like that you interesting know. sure sure so you sure. guys you do happy endings like, sorry, say no happy endings. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Are you okay. sure? I'll, put, I'll give something little. <laughs> something little. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> no, sir. <sorry. laughs> you know, it was the other people. It's yeah. the other people who are a problem. Mm, yeah. Mm, mm. So, yeah, it's only those. But funny enough, it's been two years now. Nothing. Mm. Like, I kid you not. Like, mm. nothing, nothing, nothing. So, which means I think people are waking up. Other people. Mm, I think people are waking up to see... That this is it has nothing to do. To the, okay, sure, with, sure. It, yeah, I think that, or maybe it's because I changed the workplace. Mm. Yeah, maybe other therapists are still struggling with that. But yeah, mm. but uh, funny enough, it's clean, like nothing, nothing. I nothing. think that's that's good because the reason why I'm asking that is, mm. um, um, I think I've I've done one with the where you work. Yeah, and I've done it in a different place as well. Yeah, and it's it's that thing where you see that normal. This this feels so in, intimate, mm. and it's like, and and if it's just you and you still with your partner, and someone is, it feels very intimate. <laughs> like to be honest with you, right? Mm. And 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 I, I guess it's just the, also the training of the different people to understand. Oh. Okay, this is this is a massage. There's nothing more. More. Do you understand what I mean? Mm. So um, that's why I was asking that. Uh, do you get maybe scenarios where things just goes out of hand? Mm. So that at least even the people who are actually going to, to study it, they know what are the oh, things you need to do in you know, order to get out of a situation like, like that. that. Um, like you said, I think you mentioned it very nicely to say that you can actually just either, the doors are always open yeah, or the you doors, can always yeah. just, you know, mm. spoon out of there spoon or something out. like that. You, so yeah, I think I like that. 
Mm. And um, I think uh, just moving on from that is the the spiritual side of things uh, because mm. you think you talked about stress. I mean, mm. like stress, stress. You'd think stress doesn't uh, show in the body, yeah. but it seems like you guys you are more uh, qualified to actually relieve the stress. stress. I think you said something like that. Mm. So I just want to understand. Uh, you explain this the the spiritual side of things in terms of uh, the techniques and what are you looking at. Uh, as well i think uh in terms of okay in terms of stress yes i think reflexology we we're talking about reflexology the last uh, yeah. when I, when you mentioned stress mm. so i just want to know in terms of uh because stress it, it is it's like stressing about something right mm. being worried about something yeah and then you guys being able to touch the body and mm. the 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 tension yeah, that, that's the shiatsu side. I love shiatsu. <laughs> Is it so the tension of the of 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 that stress just mm. just go away? I find it very interesting that you can just touch a certain part. Oh it's like yes, yes, yes. Point sort of uh, it's pretty yeah. pro sort of. It's like I just want to explain in terms of um, how does it happen and if you yeah. get what I mean. Uh, normally, I think it's when you're stressed, mm. your body is like in more like a shock mode okay but once the blood flows back into the body like oh oh because sometimes the other parts of the body it's like the circulation it, this stagnation it's like you are in shock mode but once we start circulating that blood so the flow and the energy channels open up mm. into the body it's like you working out, you know, when you're running. Or oh, is it like when you're running? Okay, it's like, sure, it's sure, like, because sure. it's the same. Effect. Bec- yeah, mm. because of the blood that's circulating mm. In, mm. In, in the body, okay. which gives relief. Mm. That's why it says it's relaxation mm. or it's relaxing. Mm. Those where the healing properties like comes too, <laughs> if I could mm. say. Yes, 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 yes. And then obviously with the reflex, it's like certain organs of the body are connected within your feet if i could say i've seen i've seen it where they show what where the liver is yes 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 yes, yes. that's why if you would focus more on the foot massage it gives healing to the whole body okay especially when your therapist know what he's doing when Mm. they fill those crystal at a specific point Mm. and where they press in and release press until that crystals mm. like dissolve within your feet and then you'll feel because you'll feel like the rela- relaxation or healing um just to share while i was doing my in-service training i was practicing with on my arms feet reflexology mm. still remember okay. this sure, sure. <laughs> like hey, let me because I was just practicing the sequence, you know. Mm. So it shows most the diagram, what to do, where to press. Mm. And I was just pressing. Funny enough, he had like she had a stomach issue or congestion or something with okay. it, or bloatedness. I don't know what exactly mm. it was. So I was working along her colon, the intestines. I didn't know. I was just pressing. Mm. So I was just a sound. <laughs> and then after it was done, mm. she went out and gave me like 50 bucks. Oh, thank you mm. so much. That's when like I got a wake up call that actually mm. this thing works. works. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's sure. yeah. It was in strange. How's how's how is that like, Chef? Huh? How's that like and I was to, still studying. to get to a point where you you know that you can practice um this art? Yeah. It feels like art. <laughs> it is. <laughs> <laughs> practice this art and mm. you start seeing the um, I'm sure you guys sometimes you actually have uh, clients who come regularly yeah. and they want to work with you and you mm. see the that improvement. How does that feel when you have actually work on a client and they might they feel much better? It feels like I'm a doctor. <laughs> sure. I know what I'm doing. Sure, <laughs> this thing sure. works. Mm. Yeah, it, it's it's a good feeling, mm. especially when you have. It's like when you're having as a therapist. Many people would attest to this mm. that when you have like more request. Like oh, okay, people call, sure. um, is Pumlisa working? Mm. We're like, um, let me see. Uh, I'm sorry, she's not working. When will be she in? Well, when will she be in? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and okay. they're like, uh, she's working on uh, Thursday. 
Then they'll be like, um, okay, I'll come on Thursday then. Please book me with Pumilis. Oh, when you're not there, they don't mm. book. They want Pumilis. So like, mm. hmm. Which means, you know, you there's something. You know that something. you're actually doing something. Yeah, 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 sure, yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's that, I think it's that connection with, mm. with, with, with the guest. With clients, yeah, And sure. knowing the, 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 the body and the, mus- I like, the muscles. Mm. I, I like that. I like that a lot. And um, I'll be coming soon. Yes, sir. <laughs> let's move on to business. Uh-huh. Um, do you do your own thing? Or uh, you do house calls or yes, yes, like yes, I do. Okay. Now. Before we get to get to the house calls, I just want to understand the um, the safety measures that you have for for that. What what kind of safety measures do you have for for house calls? For it's it depends. You know, if you're taking people. That you know, mm. it's hundred percent safe. Okay, there's sure, no measures effect, yeah. to even take because mm. you know this person. Mm. But now it's when you taking strangers, mm. you know, you're going to their spaces. Mm. So it's a, uh, it's it's kind of safe, but not that safe. Because mm. I remember I was on my way to work, and then I had a a, potent, a client. Because mm. at first the client was. Good, kin, no, yeah, sure. yeah, kin and good. Did the treatment in his office, and then he was like, "Fine." After the person changes, <laughs> like I, you're doing like a nice professional massage, nothing mm. like it was mm. clean. Mm. And then after the person change, I'm like, being weird. That's mm. where you see, yeah, this is not really your client. Your client, sure. Maybe because there's different. Because I saw on the internet or on Instagram, like. Mm. This industry, there's also, hey. Oh, there's yeah, also the dark side of it. <laughs> and then they think, yeah, mm, there's mm. a professional mm. side. And then there are these weird or people like trying to like mess up. Almost like escorts, sort of. Sorry? Like an escort. Like, uh, I think they call it escorts. So I think it Someone should. who just escort you, like you, 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 you book an escort. Mm. Okay, I think we'll just talk about it. <laughs> yes, tell me more about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, sure. So, which means the person didn't understand that this was actually a professional. A profit. No, thing. they come like the way they up. Okay, the way the person approached. Mm. Oh, I once went and at the where I work, mm. it was nice. I think you once did me a treat. Like, oh, really? Mm. Yeah. So this is where I work. Uh, for me, paying the company this amount of money it's better for the money goes everything Into to you body, like yeah, of sure. course you know mm, 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 and yeah it should because obviously we get like a certain sure yeah sure. like it's better for me and then i would always you'll be my okay i'll be your client yeah yeah yeah, yeah, client, yeah, yeah maybe because sure. he does massage on a regular basis like every week mm. so you can even do like two times a week oh, okay this okay. is and paying the same rate as mm. we okay this is nice okay and then organized Went there, did the thing, professional, nothing. Mm. Then when I, second time, asking weird stuff, like, huh? what is this? <laughs> Happy endings. <laughs> <laughs> no, not really, but sure. weird stuff, like, mm-hmm. I, we don't do this, you know. Mm. So it, it is safe. Mm. As a house call, house calls and doing it on your own, it's risky. I don't want to lie. It's a bit risky. But if you're specializing maybe in other treatments, okay, sure. it would be safe. But okay. even though maybe it's just other treatments, maybe just I was just going to do a facial. Mm. Who knows if the person would be like, I don't want just a facial only or anything. You know, you don't, you don't know. Mm. So it's house calls are good as a, when you're working in teams. Mm. There's someone... Makes sense. Yeah. Makes so sense. if it's just you on your own and it's someone you don't know, it's 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 a risky. It's a big red flag. Yeah, it's it's a risky. So let's it's get doable, to your business. It's risky. Mm. So what? So what? 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 Uh, what are you doing? Um, get, I don't know if you want to to share your information as well. Mm. We can do that so that at least you can get after this. You get to <laughs> a, a bump. Hey, you get as many clients. You must remember to take a podcast as well. <laughs> I'm just joking around. But um, I just want you to get to the business in terms of um, what is it that you offer as uh, as, as Pushy? Um, so as Pushy, yes. <laughs> yeah, so we offer the whole uh, 
therapeutic treatments okay, sure. such as your but for me right now i'm just offering your massages mm. and your facials okay yes okay Awesome. But I think then, next time when you have next time, hopefully I'm coming back again. Yeah, yeah, you're coming back again. <laughs> so next time when when we will be sitting together, it mm. would it would definitely having your own yeah my own practice, yeah, yeah definitely okay. Um, I think good luck with that. Episode fifty. Hundred. Not fifty. 50 oh yeah, hundred. Fifty <laughs> times two. Times two. Sure. I'll be. I'll be um, back. I, I want. I want to say thank you so much Peace. for taking this opportunity. I really appreciate it. Um. Uh, you got me. You got me to understand um, somatology. The world of wellness. <laughs> the world of wellness. <laughs> yes. And 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 um, for me, I just I just uh, my my personal uh, fascination was always here too, because mm. um, the, the pressure points. Yeah, the pressure points. Because this mm. this this other. Um, is it acupuncture? Acupuncture. Yeah, where they use needles, <laughs> Um is it acupuncture? We, they use needles. Needle. Yeah, acupuncture. No, 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 no not that one. Or oh, chiatsu. It was chiatsu yeah. with the, with the, the pressure yeah. points. The I was so surprised in terms of the effect mm. of it, and it's like you feel like the the weight has been lifted off your shoulders. Yes. And I was very much impressed, mm. and um, it's good to know that you also yeah. do something similar to similar. what you like yes, the yes. reflexology. Yes. And it's healing. It's really yeah, healing. Yeah, it, it actually is. Mm. It actually is. But uh, for those who are listening to this, um, I just want you guys to know that uh, if you want anything that talks about massages, yes. uh, the services, please talk to Pumlisa. Please share the I number. I am Pumlisa mm. Pushy mm -hmm. Faith on Instagram. On Instagram, okay. Yes. Um, so that means they will talk to you on Instagram. Like, yeah, they can just oh. DM me there. Okay. Please slide in, in the DMs there. And then she will, uh, you guys can take it from there. Yes. But thank you so much for coming through. Thank you I really so much for it. having me. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> thank you. I think maybe just before we close, I yes. usually ask my guests this. Is there anything that you want to encourage someone with the, uh, listening out there? So they say when they listen to this, um, mm. just anything that you just to encourage them. Um, anything to encourage, to encourage someone? <laughs> Uh, is that you need to have passion for somatology and then you need to have like a goal and a vision and you need to plan and not to be stagnant. You need to always thinking what's next and always research what's new, what's coming, what's no longer working because this industry is always growing and changing and mm. moving. Yeah, you always, yeah, just, yes, sir. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, see you next time when I when you come. come <laughs>